So you would like to actually create multiple Shopify stores into just one account. I'm gonna be showing you how to get started in a very easy way. So the very first thing you want to do, of course, is to understand the Shopify accounts. So it's important to clarify that each Shopify store you create will technically need its own unique Shopify account with a separate email address. So, however, you can manage these multiple accounts more seamlessly using the Shopify organization administrator if you have a Shopify Plus plan. So by using the third-party tools or browse management strategies for regular plans. So if you focus here into the upper side, you see that we have all the stored section. Directly here into all the stores, you see that we have stores created, which one are active and which one are inactive. As you can see, we're now able to create multiple stores and of course manage all of them directly into Shopify. So setting up additional Shopify stores. To set up an additional Shopify store, you need to go through the standard setup process for each new store. So as you can see, we are directly into the different email ads to register each new store, completing the initial setup by choosing a store name. So I go for create new store and adding the products and configuring the settings. I'm gonna skip all of this and using the Shopify Plus for multiple stores. So let's say for example that I currently, the country go for next, remind me next time. And this administrator tool, I'm gonna to list the list like that, go into this new section of the Shopify. And you can see that we are now, uh, this one has now of course been the new dashboard of the new section of my store. So as you can see here, inside this actual section of the Shopify, into the upper side, you can see that we have the administrator Shopify.com store and the fast forward slash and this actual code. This code is something specific for each Shopify store that you're actually creating. So this one ends with a B0. And if I check into the other one, you can see that we have an actual administrator that ends with 03. So that means that we have multiple stores now being created into just one email. So if I click here into my store, you can see that we have more than just one store created. As you can see, we have the flamed element and we have the my store. So now let's focus directly into the new plants. Now, using Shopify Plus and multiple stores, if you're using the Shopify Plus, you can take advantage of the organization administrator feature. Now this allows you to manage all your stores on the one organization. You can switch between stores from a single dashboard, share information between stores and a stream-like building process. So if I hit into the actual plan, for example, you should see that we have the basic plan. Now the basic plan comes with an actual basic 24 seven localized selling POS and one headline storefront. You don't have actually any access of the additional staff account. But if you're using the actual Shopify plan, you might be having up to new 10 inventory locations, 24 seven chat to poll, localized global selling, five additional staff account and the actual POS light which is why we actually if you're actually focusing to create multiple Shopify stores into just one account focus into the one that has inventory location and more than additional two staff account so if you're focused only into the basic plot you might be having the actual element of just one person focusing into this store if I have an actual current plan, that will be the actual plan for only one store. But if I wanted to get started with more than one store, I needed to go here and of course choose the option that says all the stores. Directly into all my stores, I can of course create an actual new store and it's gonna be, let's say for example, starting all over again. That means that we needed to have an actual active current plan in order to continue. So we needed to pay of course differently and separately if you're actually having an actual current plan into this website and you need to do exactly the same thing into the other one. That's the reason why we're actually going to be showing you guys and the best thing that you can do if you want to manage more than just one store is to choose an affordable price to get started with. Nowadays, the actual new Shopify comes with an actual starter plan. The starter plan is actually like the best tool so far and the most affordable for people who wanted to just have an actual limited store and to sell directly only into the socials. So if I go directly here into my online store, what I can do if I hit into online store, if I hit now into customize, it should be taking me directly into the editor of my actual store. Into the next store, I'm gonna open a new tab, go for the online store, and go directly here inside this new section of the current theme. 
Now, as you can see, this actual new section is making the respect mode. And the delivery section is going to be really easy to organize. I can just edit my store here. I go for the next tab. And as you can see, I am into the next new store section, which I think is going to be really great to manage multiple account and multiple website as I am just getting started. And even I can create a new store, of course, and get started by adding just one product or more than just one product. And lastly, if I go into applications, I can go here into the upper side and look out for application that can be helping me to manage more than one store and into one account. For example, the multi administrator multi store, where you can see that we have all the different stores with all the different names, the SKU, the current prices, the orders that we have available into just one place in just one account. So of course, of course, this actual plan comes with an actual price. But you wanted to make sure that if you're making really great sales into this actual Shopify, I'm going to be telling you that the third part, the application is going to be the best tool so far to get started with Amherst to more than just one store. So guys, with that being said, we can now reach to the very end of the video. Share and subscribe to the channel if you want to see more amazing tools of how you can make the administrator for just more than one store inside Shopify with only one account. Thank you so much for watching the video. Hopefully, with all the happenings, you can see it to a brand new section of TechQuest. See you next time.